Alright, what's going on dudes? Welcome back to Minecraft. We're gonna be checking out another command block creation. This one gives us the ability to make airships. It's sort of like the Archimedes Airships mod, which you may have seen before, except it's not a mod. So let's get started. Boom! Hit the button, and let's do it. Archimedes Airships has been installed. This command was created by Mr. Goretto to craft an airship control panel, which we need to make an airship, throw an iron block, and a piston on the ground together. So, it says Archimedes Airships, that's the name of it, once again, like, all powered by the single command block, no mods involved whatsoever. So, we got a piston, got a block of iron, and those are the, uh, the building blocks that we need in order to make the controller. So, let's drop them on the ground, and there we go. Alright, so we've now got the, uh, the ship control panel, and we'll need that in order to, like, initiate our, our airship, like the helm with Archimedes Ships, when you actually have the mod installed. So, we have four compatible blocks when it comes to at least this vanilla command block creation. We can use these to, to build a ship of our choosing. So let's make something that looks kind of interesting. We can build it straight on the ground because it won't pick up any of the sand. So we should be good to go on that. Um, how wide do I want to make it? We'll do like five wide and then build it like so. And then we'll kind of like, I don't know, make it look like a ship or something. It's probably not going to be the most beautiful thing you've ever seen, but <laughs> we'll do our best. All right, there we go. That'll be like the base of it. And then um, just put like some, some balloons in the back or maybe, no, we'll attach some balloons up top. So you also put down some fences. So we'll do that. It's just going to be a really, really flat ship. You know, it's, it's cool. So we'll do some fences around the outside. And then if we want to, we could uh, do some balloons up top so that it looks like it's realistically an airship or something like that. So here we go. All right, and now we'll use that to attach all the balloons to. And I don't actually know if there's a maximum amount of blocks you're allowed to have in your airship, but hopefully this will work. And you can also put ladders in if you want. So if we wanted to, I don't know, attach some up here, pretty useless, but ladders are compatible too. So we got a super basic airship now. Yeah, hooray! Doesn't look like it really has enough balloons to fly, but that's fine. We'll just add a couple more to make it look realistic. Okay, beautiful. All right, so last but not least, we need to actually put down the ship control panel. So we can do that anywhere, as long as it's touching all the blocks. And we'll put it right there in this case. It does a really cool little, like, uh, item frame scan, scanimation. I don't know what it's doing, probably something important. And now uh, we got our ship controls down there. Okay, so all we need to do to fly the thing is right click the ship controls and uh, we're ready to go. So fences kind of separate from each other so they're all individual because I assume it turns them into some sand entity thingamadoohicker, but we have our controls. So I can hit, uh, I'm clicking with my mouse, so I go into the text window and then I can click ascend and then the airship should Start to ascend, and it looks like we lost the front. That was probably like too many blocks or something like that. Well, there it goes. All right. See you. Front of the ship. And so I can keep clicking ascend, and every time I do that, it'll bring us up a little bit higher. If I hit F5 here, it gives us a little better view. Hey, at least we got all the back of the ship and all the balloons. So we're good. All right. Let's keep hitting ascend and keep on going up. So as opposed to Archimedes ships, like you can't just control it with keys. You have to actually go into your text and then um, and keep clicking on it and then it'll keep ascending you higher and higher and higher and when we're high enough and we're not worried about hitting into anything then we can click the unanchor button and then we'll be able to actually start flying so come on keep on ascending we don't want to hit into any of the trees over there raise the ship captain captain sparkles that is all right so we should be high enough right now now we can unanchor it and uh, here we go we're going so it'll go wherever we're looking. It's basically, I, I'm pretty sure everything is parented to some sort of magical flying horse. I don't know exactly how it works, but armor stands, falling sand, tile entity things, horses. Um, I am riding a horse right now. That's why I'm in sitting position and I can jump. <laughs> Interestingly enough, on my magical invisible armor stand horse, whatever the heck this is. Woohoo! All right, so we're flying through the air on our beautiful airship. Isn't it just wonderfully lovely? It's pretty great, if you ask me. I don't actually fully know what happened to our second level of balloons, but... Oh god, now we're going backwards. So, um, 
One of the drawbacks is the ship doesn't actually reorient itself. I'm pretty sure you just can't do that in, in vanilla, but I mean, it is what it is. It doesn't also go really fast at all. There's only one speed, and again, it goes wherever you're looking. So if you want to go the other way, you just have to look that way and the ship starts reversing, basically. But for being all done in vanilla, it's actually pretty friggin' phenomenal. The fact that this is able to be done with no mods, uh, kind of mind-blowing. So if we want to park our ship, for example, say we've gone really far. We've gone all of like uh, 50 meters here. So, you know, it's a pretty big trek that we've accomplished. Like we probably want to take a lunch break or something. So go back into text, drop our anchor here, and that'll lock us back down. And now if I get off here, boom, it morphs back into just regular old blocks. So now I'm actually in a position where if I want to, I can modify the ship. So I could destroy a block here, or add in some more, see if it'll allow us to, I don't know. Again, I think we may have put too many blocks down, but hey, it is what it is. Or add a fence over here just so we don't have the ability to fall off. And it actually has this pretty cool like anchor animation thing, um, or the particle showing us that we've dropped anchor. So pretty nifty. And then again, if we wanna get going once more, it's just as easy as uh, right clicking and uh, we are off and we lost the fence on the front again. What a sad story, man. An anchor once more and we're off. Woohoo! And then if I wanted to descend, I can descend. We'll hit F5 again and <laughs> we lost some more balloons. Oh well, you know, it has its drawbacks occasionally. Farewell pieces of the ship. Um, and then let's descend a little bit. We can descend, descend, descend some more. And I uh, just have to keep clicking it and um, We'll keep on heading downwards until we want to uh, drop anchor again and stick in place. So that's that. And um, yeah, could make a, if we made a smaller ship, it would probably be like slightly more compatible with things. So we could quickly put together something over here that's just um, super basic. Like how about we just put down a few pieces of wood over here and then we'll put down this and this and this. It's just a little scan thing with the item frames, and now we can just go on our, our little baby ship. Just a little baby ship, which uh, we left the wood behind. Whoops. Maybe it shouldn't be touching the ground. Oh, well. I'm learning as I go here. Uh, <laughs> I may have... Oh, wait. That's, that's quite strange. Oh, well. I made a boo-boo. It's no big deal. Uh, <laughs> you don't want to dismount before you uh, drop anchor, but anyway. That's um that's the Archimedes ships in vanilla uh not mod. It's Archimedes it's the Archimedes ship not mod. So I I hope you've enjoyed. Uh if you have, a rating would be super duper very much appreciated. Maybe we could get like uh 15 likes on the video or something like that. And um there we go. Let's ascend. Hey, there we go. All right, we're all good to go again. Um <laughs> Now we're in good shape. We're all moving. It's all together. Good. I wanted to end on a high note there. So we got a working little miniature ship and now all the blocks are, are as they should be. So, all right. Well, thanks very much for watching. And um, I guess I will see you next time. I'm going to go cruise around the world. See ya.